you're saying I look good, I'm all in sync, all that wonderful jazz. Beautiful then, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. I'm gonna be right back. I just want to plug my phone in because I am downloading a mixer video, um, and it is eating the shiz out of my battery. I'd be right back. I'm just gonna run into the living room here. I just want to kill this so I don't tax my shit. Hi, lightning. Damn. Loud. Okay. Well, I'll put you back. In the oh God. Okay, so apparently I better leave that on. Be back. Let me just pull. Jumpy, sorry. Would have been in here sooner, but my girlfriend had me tied up. Sure, honey. Because we all know John Beast is beating him off with a stick. <laughs> it's a very small stick. Probably very breakable. Too late. I already walked away with the headset. It didn't snap, crackle, and pop, but that's because I didn't go very far. Now, if I go all the way to the kitchen, oh yeah. Oh yeah. Alright, everybody. So today, this isn't my normal streaming time, and I thought, let's do something a little different. Away from Oblivion for a little bit. We're gonna play some Fable 2. This is also a very old game. So everybody who is watching, welcome back to the memory card, the station that plays older games for nostalgic memory. I'm Darth Beauty. Let's get it on. And so our story begins. Well, been a while since I heard that voice. John Beast. Wow, was that a veiled diss about my manhood? A small stick? Probably very breakable? No, I'm just saying you don't have a lot going on there, honey, as far as women coming after you, so you don't need a very big stick to beat them off. Okay, I got the subtitles on. Good, because sometimes I can't understand what they're saying. All right, new game. But who is the hero of our tale? God, it's been a while since I've heard this woman's voice. Oh god, John Beast, I will talk to you later when I meet. That's not what I meant. Not like that. Oh my god. <laughs> I, I meant... You, you, okay, sure. They're all lies. Whatever helps you sleep better, baby. <laughs> god. Alright, so I generally almost always play the girl. Because I am a girl. Then like let her better. destiny unfold. <laughs> Tommy's, I knew it! <laughs> it's like your favorite line in all of Brave. <laughs> when he sits there slams that woman into the stone wall. I knew it! Mm, mm, mm. Hey, John Beast, remember this opening? I am going to let this roll, folks, because... Oh, wow, do you need to see the grab? Look at this! Hey, that's practically photorealistic. And this game is old! <sighs> oh, Jesus, how old? Oh, damn, that's a good question. Um, John Beast, I don't have my phone. Do us all a favor for the memory card. If you would, pull up Fable 2 release date. And if you wouldn't mind, put that into our chat box. Probably old enough to be a new memory card series. I'm sure it's more than 10 years. Look it up for me, John Beast, because she's got to be at least 10 to be on the memory card. At least uh, officially on the memory card. Watch this, guys. Watch this! Photo realistic bird poop. <laughs> NZI. Well, I hear that's lucky. Like finding a four-leaf clover. 
<laughs> Although I think I prefer the clover. Yeah, no shit. Oh, look, little sparrow. Elty, Elty. Castle Fairfax looks so nice in the snow. Fable 2 was Imagine released the grand dining October hall. 21st, 2008. I bet Lord Lucian's having roast duck this time of year. But he must be really lonely since his wife and his little old. girl died. It is memory card. In that big castle, all uh, by himself. Worthy. Absolutely. If only we could live there. And that was such a photorealistic opening. On it, yes, an 11 year old game. Yes, John Beast. What is going on over there? Come with me, sis. Alright, so obviously in this game, you played the little girl, or little boy, depending on what you chose. Hello there, Follow young the Rose. Blowing trail. You look hungry. Have you reconsidered my offer? We'll never be that hungry. The answer is no. You'll be back, and I'll be waiting for you. Unfortunately, you can only play this game in third person Come view. Come on, little sparrow. Let's see what's first. going on. And, of course, this person is your older sister. That filthy creep. I hate him. We got oh, that. it's just a trader. I can't see anything past this lot. A ladies and a gentleman. All right, John Beast, you take, be safe. I have traveled the land, accumulating wondrous and mysterious objects, which I now offer to you for the modest price of five gold. Hey, did someone just pitch my bottom? Consider this. This is truly a magical mirror. I'm sorry for being For as so long quiet. as you look into it, it will make so you beautiful. I'm just kind of listening to this now. I'll take it. Very wise. Now, just remember, the magic only works if you look at it in complete darkness. Ah, now this is truly a marvel. There's a change of music. This small, unassuming box is, is actually games, a device movies, created anything. by the Usually ancients, as hard. used by the old kingdom rulers themselves. <laughs> Turn the handle three times, and you shall be granted a single wish. There's no such thing as magic. We live in grim times indeed, if the young are too world-weary to believe in magic. Most children your age believe eagerly. Look, I can see your eyes are bad, but I'm telling you, that music box is rubbish. That's what the seller thinks. He has no idea what he stumbled upon, <laughs> but I you have a inkling, don't you? Mm, Some sucks. part of you wants to believe it's magic. What? You, you really think it could be? <laughs> For five gold, gold coins, you could have your answer. <laughs> For five gold coins, we could eat for a week. I'll take food. Listen to me, Rose. At the end of that week, you and your little sparrow would be no closer to your dream. No closer to the inside of that beautiful castle. What if it is real? I bet we could get five gold pieces. What was pieces, I thinking? I was thinking of food, John Beast. be a way out of here after You all. know me better than that. What is there to lose, little sparrow? Come on. There must be someone around here who'll pay us gold to... do something. Alright. Now, many of you might be wondering, if this is Fable 2, why am I not playing Fable 1? Reason being is that Fable 1, for me, I've never really been able to get into it. I don't find it very user-friendly as far as the menus and such, but it was also the first game. Come on, they were still trying to figure out things. Fable 2, things got infinitely better as far as a better menu system, um, much more user-friendly, that sort of thing. So, that's another reason why I kind of start with Fable 2, but... If you know the fable lore, then you know who that blind woman is. <laughs> yeah, she is really old. Going into our options. Subtitles are on. I've got my glow trail very bright so I can see it. Tutorials are on. Online orbs. Friends only, everybody, or you can turn it off. The, front, the orbs, basically, if one of your... Uh, or your peeps are online, or even if you just have it as everybody, anytime you see somebody online playing this game, you'll see the orb, which means yes! 
you can play with friends on this game. Uh, you know what? Just so everybody can see how... Whether or not this game is even still popular. I'm going to turn the orbs on. Now, what this means is you won't actually see their character running around, unfortunately. Unless you two are joined up together in the game. You'll just see an orb running around the town. And basically what that's telling you is, hey, this person's also playing and this is where they're at. But they're in a different sequence, so you're not really playing together. But you can interact, invite them, and now you will see their character. Um, I am going to turn off the auto-joinable. No, I don't want people joining me unless I either give them an invite or at least they ask. <laughs> John Beast, which means if I was playing with you, tease you, would you be able to see my ball floating around? I don't know, honey, would I? Again, I'm going to put the online orbs to everyone. We're going to see just how many people still play this game. I, I want, I'm curious now. I really am. On video, uh, this is where you can adjust things. I like to keep it kind of bright because I'm sorry. I'm, as you can see, my eyesight's not the greatest. But you said you like balls flying at your face. Oh dear lord. I give up with you. My invert, I'm putting that on. I'm sorry, I like inverted controls. I cannot play when I'm not inverted. Oh my god. Sounds are up. I'm going to turn the music down just a touch, but I want the Make voices a wish. up. I want to be able to hear the people. But I'm going to keep the sounds just a little bit low. There we go. Alright. John Beast, what do you stand on your head while you're playing the game? It'll look like your controls are inverted. I, I, I give up with you. I really do. So our first object, we have to make five gold minute. pieces by doing things for people so we can purchase Hello, the music Gary. box. Loosening. Oh, let's get over here to the sheriff deputy. My arrest warrants blew right out of my hands. They Any could place? be in all corners of Bowerstone by now, and I can't leave my post. Bowerstone, hey, obviously. Why don't you the name find the them for me? Starting in. You could be like uh, little constables. Sounds fun, right? How much do little constables get paid? Paid? Listen, kids, these are the five most wanted criminals in Bowerstone. Yeah? Yeah? Well, how badly do you want them? Fine. One gold for all five warrants. Now, you'll notice it says um, up here at the top, Albion's most wanted. Hold A to skip the dialogue and accept the quest. So in order to accept the quest, just hold A down. It'll start filling up. Deal. And there you go. So our first quest is find the, the five The blew off in that direction. Through the alley by that bloke with a picture box. Okay. Oh, let's <laughs> get so going. Look out for those warrants. But for now, let's find some more money. Here's another guy. Obviously he's got the exclamation point. Hello, children. Hello. What's that? This? I'll let the dialogue run. Why, it's, been it's a only long the most amazing too. device ever conceived. I can't remember the last time I played it this game. It grabs your very likeness and transfiddles it onto a magic piece of paper. It's going to make me very rich. If only I could find someone to modelify for it. We'll do it for a gold piece. Hmm. I only have one gold left. But you're right, I should investalize it in my new venture. Uh, deal. A Dude, gold piece just hustle. to stand there. Sounds alright, doesn't it? Alright, so... Load of go up here. Oh, I'm sorry. <clears throat> Old A to accept. A picture of two cute kids like you, bound to soften a few hearts. What do you say? What is that? Now, all you have to do is strike a pose for my little device. You'll be positively betwazzled by the results. Oi vey. Be what? Ah, yes, I've been improving my vocabularium with a wonderful book bought from Mergo the Trader. A thesaurus. Mergo, by the way, is He's the guy trying silly, to sell the uh, this could music be fun. box. 
And this is where you got to learn how to do poses. Load of crap. Oh no, no. Hmm. That was somewhat lacking. I in... did not want to do that. Well, it was oh, just plain nasty. All I'm right. Afraid. Hang on, guys. I did but not. But I only to do have that. one sheet of magic paper, so it'll have to do. Dang it. Load of crap. No. Now, I just have to wait three months for the picture to developify, no, and I can start no, showing no, it around. No, oh, I can almost smell the gold. <laughs> three months, he says. Told you it was a swindle. Ugh. That was fun. Okay, seriously, stop pausing a scene. And we've got How do I get the menu coin? back? Thank you. Okay. <sighs> Quit and don't save. That's what I'm looking for. It's been so long, guys. I I apologize for not really speaking very much, but it's been so long. I'm trying to I'm trying to remember everything. Okay. I'm starting this over because, no, that's not what I wanted to do, but the bloody thing wasn't. And so our story begins. That guy reminds me of Owaka, oh, the 23rd, Final Fantasy X. Hell yeah. <laughs> but who is the hero game. of our tale? Then let her destiny unfold. All right, all right, let's, let's try this again. I did not want to do that. I was waiting for the directionals to come up telling me. I didn't know the second I choose something, he was going to snap the picture. That's kind of bullshittery. Alright, we've already seen it. It was a beautiful opening. Very photorealistic, but... Oh, what was that? Move on. Oh, yuck. Well, I, go through this. I hear that's this lucky. Game. Like finding a four-leaf clover. <laughs> Although I think I prefer the clover. Oh, look, little sparrow. Castle uh, no, Fairfax looks so nice it was kind of in realistic. the snow. Wow, bite me, John. <laughs> Imagine the grand dining hall. I bet Lord Lucian's having roast duck this time of year. But he must be really lonely since his wife and his little girl died. In that big castle, all by himself. If only we could live there. What is going on over there? Come with me, sis. Alright. Hello there, young Rose. Oh. You look hungry. Okay, so this. Have you reconsidered up my offer? A wheel. We'll never be that right hungry. bumper. The answer is no. You'll be back, and I'll be waiting for you. Sorry, I totally squirreled. I I was discovering my controllers. I ate him. Whoa, have you seen that thing over there? No oh, way. it's just a trader. I can't see anything past this lot. Now, obviously to zoom in, I'm holding down the left trigger, and you have to continue. Ladies and as soon as you let go, that. I have so traveled the land, around. accumulating wondrous and mysterious objects, which I now offer to you for the modest price of five gold. Consider this. This is truly a magical mirror. He knows he doesn't so as long as you look into it, it will make you money. beautiful. <laughs> I'll take it. Very wise. Now, just remember, the magic only works if you look at it in complete darkness. Ah, now this is truly a marvel. Change of music? This small, unassuming box is actually a device created by the ancients, as used by the old kingdom rulers themselves. <laughs> Turn the handle three times, and you shall be granted a single wish. Hey, John Beast, I'm pretty sure you played, There's no such um, thing as magic. Fable 1. 
When you're in a place where we you live in grim respond. times indeed. Let me if know the young are if too you world weary to believe in magic. First fable game. Most children your age believe eagerly. Look, I can see your eyes are bad, but I'm telling you, that music box is rubbish. That's what the seller thinks. He has no idea what he stumbled upon. But you have an inkling, don't you? Some part of you wants to believe it's magic. What? You... you really think it could be? For five gold coins, you could have your answer. I love her response. For five gold coins, we could eat for a week. Listen to me, Rose. At the end of that week, you and your little sparrow would be no closer to your dream. No closer to the inside of that beautiful castle. What if it is real? I bet we could get five gold pieces. And maybe this could be a way out of here after all. What is there to lose, little sparrow? Yeah, really. Come on. Nothing there must be someone around here who'll pay us gold to... do something. Alright, let's pick up this quest like we did originally. Oi, kids! Come here a minute! I need to hire you. <laughs> Hello, Derek. Lose something? My arrest warrants blew... The warrants blew off in that direction. Through the alley by that bloke with a picture box. I skipped it because we already saw this dialogue. We know what he says. So, we're gonna stop by here. Those warrants. But for now, let's find with some more With a lifelike instant image. <laughs> Pull the other one. I'm just going to skip his dialogue, and this is where I'm just going to wait until I see Now, you. all you have to do is strike... Very well. Strike a pose, my young friend. Okay. <laughs> Waiting for it to go green, and there we go. Oh. Ooh. Wondrous. This thing's going to be more popular than that pot. Everything you do affects your purity. It affects your reputation. Now, I just have to wait three it months for the picture the to develop, and I can start reaction. showing it around. You're very oh, I can almost actually... smell the gold. Um, <laughs> three you can months, actually he affect says. The way the city Told you it was ends a swindle. up looking, Okay. This game truly is Easy money cause for us. and effect. He's a bit scary. Hope he's all right. Action and consequence. I'm not sure. So, just... yeah. We got our first gold coin, though. All right. This must be the alley the warrants blew down. We should take a look. Come on! Rick's caught a dog, and he's gonna kick the crap You like that, you stupid mutt? Hey! What the hell are you doing? Having a bit of fun. What's it to you? Oh! He hit a girl. Yeah, and now I'm gonna hit another one. This is our neighborhood. Show him. All right, now he's glowing red. X button to use your wooden sword. Get the shit out of this guy. I mean, he's attacking a dog. Ah! Stop it! Let me alone, you nutter! Ow! Did you see that? That lunatic shot me right in the head! Thanks for your help. I could have taken him, though. Now, of course, all the kids are cheering me. They're like, hey, hey, good job. At least you beat him. I guess that means nobody really liked him. But whatever. Oh, poor thing. You've had a horrible time. Don't be scared. I won't hurt you. What you need is someone nice to look after you. Oh, we can't keep you. We don't have enough food for ourselves. Well, I'm sorry, but we can't. Now you just rest. Oh, poor puppy dog. It's Come on, little sparrow. Too. Let's go. <laughs> now you notice a little thing just went above my oh, head. It shows like a little face with a halo and it said four. I performed a good deed as you saw up there and I just got good morale for it. It's been way too long since I played the first fable so I don't remember if there's a music box in that game or not. Okay. 
That was John Beast responding. Um, again, he played the first Fable. He actually beat the first Fable. I just, I could not get into it. Alright, let's see. Is this one of Looks them? Like it is! Has done it. Pick it up. And yes, you can read them. Ronnie rhymes with arsonist. Wow. <laughs> John Beast, please! I beat all the fables like they owed me money. Yeah, I remember that. You did. All the fables. I think there were three of them total. He beat them all. 19 counts of setting fire to public property or an officer of the peace. Whoa. Alright. So there you have it. That's one. Well, Continuing we along. have our first warrant. Here's another one. Excuse me. Here's do? another one. Warrant for sneakiness. Ew. Again, hitting Y, you can actually read who they're looking for. John Beast, crunchy chick, crunchy chick. Oh dear God, yes. I can't wait till we get to that part. <laughs> Leroy, unremarkable stone. Leroy, ten fingers. Leroy, one nose. Leroy, two eyes. Has hair. Is alive. Yeah, you get the feeling nobody really knows what this guy looks like. Suspicious through otherwise unremarkable behavior. Okay, so there's a warrant for him being unremarkable. I have to question yes, the another um, warrant. law and order around hmm. here. I don't think they'll miss this Leroy if they see him. Ah, they really won't. I need up, a drink. Up, up. No, you don't. Pick it up. Warrant for burglary. Alan, alliteration, Ultima. Wanted for breaking and entering, breaking and smashing, breaking, repeatedly stomping upon, breaking, gluing back together, and trying to pass off as not ever having been broken in the first place. Really? <laughs> Take that. We've got You're three right, now. Betty. Just You're two more to go. Now you'll notice all the rubble down there. You cannot go down there. But there is more to the city. It's just right now you do not have access to it. So yeah, it's all blocked off. Oh my god, I forgot well, how much this drives me back crazy. For me so I can tell it to shut up. Okay, let's see what's going on here. Hey, look at that, Betty. Two sets of twins. Oh, you'll get my booze back, won't you? You can barely stand as it Two is. Two sets of twins, damn. But this they so can. Double on Bet they can walk straight, even. Get my booze back from that git magpie, and I'll give you a gold piece for it. He's not even a proper beggar, has piles of stuff, and it's all stolen from bodified tramps like my good self. <laughs> He's a bottom. Of Let tramp. it go, Pete. Save your money for important things. It is his money. Can't he decide how to spend it? She's making all kinds of sense. Well, let's talk about my money. You find that bottle, and I'll pay you to keep it out of his hands. Hold to accept. Come on, help Don't an old man oh, out. God, would you people stop talking? So you'll bring me back my bottle? Yes. Oh, no. You'll find it and bring it to me, won't you, children? Wow, people would shut up. Thank you, John Beast. Man, if there Let's is find an arrest offense, I would be in jail for board bedroom activities alone being unremarkable. Dude, we'd both be in jail for being unremarkable, okay? Okay, I've got That must be Magpie. And there's the button. <laughs> Get it, little sparrow. Don't wake him up. I can't remember if there is a way to Hang on. Friends would get an old man his drink back. Out of friendship. I won't let you slowly kill yourself. Wait. Uh, nope. Why do you say slowly? Would you let me quickly kill you? Alright, as I recall, you have to kind of walk up on this guy kind of nice and easy like. So, give me just a minute here. That must be Magpie. And there's the bottle. 
Get it, little sparrow. But don't wake him up. Not something you can rush on. So I gotta remember how I do this. Ooh, ooh, you can knock that stuff over and I imagine that will wake him up. So I guess I need to be real careful. Bottle of potent booze, roughly stoppered with a scroll of paper. Okay. Ah, stupid Pete. You snooze, I take your booze. Ah. Let's go collect our gold from the lady and the tramp. There we go. There we go. Okay, yeah. You had to get up Quickly real kill nice. myself. Hey, the quadruplets are back. You've got booze. I can smell it. Are you sure it's not your breath? I'll give you a gold piece for it. Sounds good to me. No, don't fall off the wagon. Wagon? Where? Kids, look out for the wagon. Does he sound like he needs that? Here, I'll give you a gold piece for it. You know, lady, if you were smart, give me the wine. Well, you probably should have done is give us no, two don't. gold for it. Give it to me. See, I got plus three. Hold it. There's some paper in the bottle. I think this is yours. Warrant for gun toting. Okay. Here we go. This is an interesting one. Andrew the Stammer M M Miller wanted for assault with a firearm, stealing glances at a firearm. Whispering sweet nothings to a firearm. Proposal of marriage to a firearm. Hurling a firearm into a public waterway in anger. Also, one count of public intoxication. <laughs> I used These to be an accountant. Don't drink, it'll ruin your life. <laughs> you admit it. Um, I guess I do. From this day forth, I shall stay sober and return to my career as a tax and pensions consultant. Oh, you poor man. Sure you don't want the bottle? Well done. You probably saved his life. <laughs> I'll probably go and back to my career and he's coin. like, We're really that's funny, because then she's just like, okay, you know now, what? Now, let's find the rest of those warrants. Butt. Did everybody just see that? <laughs> oh, my character just scratched its, her butt. Okay, there's another one up here. Oh, oh, yes, you can read signs. Read. Our stone cemetery. The cemetery is where we cannot get to. Be right back. Got to get food, fuel, all that good stuff. All right, baby, take your time. Let's be safe. Let's talk to this guy. Need help with something? Oh, boy, does he. Uh, ever. sort of, yes. You kids aren't afraid of... Uh... Beatles, are you? No, that would be silly. Yes, silly. <laughs> no one's afraid of loathsome, evil, conniving beetles. Well, uh, since you're not afraid, uh, how would you like to ruthlessly exterminate a few that are in my warehouse? Sounds good. We'll do it for a gold piece. Done. Ooh, I hope you can make them suffer. If those hideous vermin ever can suffer. Hold to accept. Boom. Shoot the beetles. Shoot to kill. And while you're breaking their hateful little heads open, try not Everybody to break any of my the guy stuff. To the left. Yeah. Hey, kid. Balthazar owes some protection money to Nicky the Nickname. Mm. So how about you leave the Beatles and smash his stock up instead? I'll give you a gold on Mr. the Nickname's behalf. Alright, so. Ugh. I remember a little bit now about how much I hated the controls and the camera. 
camera. Oh, crap. Do you know what I had to do to get those beetles? I'll remember this, kid. Again, your consequences have ac your actions have consequences. He will remember you. That was a massacre. No mercy for the filthy buggers. That's what I like to see. And all my stock is still intact. Genius. Now I think about it, I wonder how those beetles got in there. Oh, it is snowing. I guess they're looking for a warm place. You know how it is, buddy. Wow! I didn't know you were so good at fighting. That's three gold coins now. Just two more and we can buy the music box. Who gives me the fit? Oh. Hey, puppy dog! Who's that dog again? Warrant for assault. Oh boy, these are good. Nikki the nickname Chalmers. Hey, how about that? Wanted for yeah, I love this. Known aliases. Nikki the nickname Chalmers. Chalmers. No relation. <laughs> Wanted for assault with a deadly weapon. Assault with a potentially deadly weapon. Assault with a weapon we can't believe could possibly be deadly, but unfortunately was. <laughs> oh wait, there was more. Wanted dead or mortally wounded. Huh. Hey, you found one on for all us. Good boy. Oh, I know. You're sweet. But I told you before, we can't keep you. Why Come not? on, little sparrow. Say we keep the doggy. That's all the warrants. We should go back to that guard. Okay, which one of these is my menu? Ah, okay, menu. Haha. -ha. Items. Miscellaneous. Uh, excuse me. Oh, good lord. Weapons. The ass, the apostrophe usually indicates that you have something new in your inventory under that category. Let's move along. I'm trying to remember who else gives me a gold coin. This guy's only going to give me one gold coin. Oh, I remember. I remember. I remember. <laughs> Let's get back to Hello. the deputy and then I'll. Oh, oh sweet oh. little boy. <laughs> Stop right there, you little brats. Ah. If you remember, that's the guy that was... Listen, creep. I told you no this morning. Shut it, girl. This isn't about that. Mm. Those warrants you're collecting, I want them. So does our friend the guard. Yeah, but you're going to give them to me, see? Otherwise, there'll be trouble. Ooh. There'll be trouble, all right. You take these, and I'll tell our friend what you really want. All right, you little hard case. What's he paying you? A gold piece? I'll give you a gold right here. Save you to walk back. Hmm. A gold's a gold, I guess. If you want the money right now, you could give him the warrants. Now you're talking, girl. On the other hand, he's scum. Oh, stop. You're going to make me break down weeping. All right. So if you don't want to give him the money, uh, give him the warrant, just run right going? past him and go to the guard. I'm or you can give him town. the warrant. Then you're still going to get your gold piece, but again, sorry. actions have consequences in this game. Giving it to him instead of a little angel head, you're liable to get a little devil head and get points towards that. And I can't remember where I go to see where I'm at with Thing is, I don't think I can yet, so that's all right. Have you found them? Yes, we did. Thanks. You're Five a lifesaver. Being a good person. Now, normally, justice is its own reward, but as these aren't normal circumstances, there's your gold piece. <laughs> he sounds thrilled, don't he? That's just so out this town. Your ears made now. 
Four gold coins. We just need one more. And I know right where I need to go. Lord Lucian. No, no, no. Too formal. Shh. I think Mother heard us. You again? I don't want you sniffing around my daughter. Now push off before I call the guards, you animal. Get in the house, Belinda. And clean those floors. They're as filthy as that no-good delinquent Monty. Speak to Monty. What's the matter with you? Oh, little ones. My situation Sky. is unbearable. Words can't even begin to describe it. Looks to me like you fancy the girl who lives there, but her mum thinks you're rubbish, so she's locked her away. Uh, I suppose that's the gist of it. Why'd you ask me then? Maybe we could help you. Yes! You could take my proposal letter to the fair maiden. Oh, there is hope. My heart soars in my chest like, like... We'll do it for a gold piece. There's always a ah, caveat for oh, sister. I'm a bit strapped right at the moment. But Belinda's good for it. I'm sure she'll pay you when she receives my letter. Sorry. I'm coming. Ah, I'm... There we go. And you get to read his letter. Darling, run away with me. Like two doves, we shall rise on love's gentle breeze to soar above the world in our bliss, forever embracing in the clouds. Monty. Ah. <sighs> get that letter straight to Belinda. Don't let her mum get it. Okay. No problem. Knock on the door and let's see who answers. What do you want? Ah! Oh, um, we, we've got a letter. We need one gold for the postage. Oh, well, why didn't you just say so? Come on in. Wait there while I get the money. And don't you touch anything. Oh. <gasps> Monty told us not to give it to the mother, but she'll pay us if we just wait here. But then, if we give it to Belinda upstairs, maybe they can run away together. That must be Belinda. Yep. I don't know. Well, this is wonderful. Here's something for your trouble. Oh, Gold Monty, point. my little dove. <laughs> I guess some people's wishes do come true. Stop glitching we into did the wall. It. We can buy the music box now. Belinda, what are you doing? Get back in the house. I'm leaving, Mother. I'm going to marry the man I love. What? Oh, Monty, I love you. No, you don't. He's poor. Oh, Mother, you're such a shrew. That's why Father left you, and you can't get another man. Belinda, you shouldn't talk to your mum like that. Oh, now you're taking her side. <laughs> what? No. Well, maybe you should marry her instead. But you're my one true love. Without you... There are no stars and no moon in my night sky. Only the cold, crushing dark of your absence, um, my little dove. Wow. Trying to think fast? Oh god, quit humping the wall. Jesus. Walk straight. Man, it's been a while since I played a third-person view video game. Because that's the thing. I, I Come on, let's it. go buy that music box. Yes. I can't wait oh, to see yes. what it can do. Oh, I bet you can. 
Hello, children. Hello. We've come to buy the music box. Very wise, little ones. All right. A small music box that trembles with energy at your touch. Does that sound normal? Go ahead and turn the handle, but mind you go somewhere quiet like. Let's go make our wish, little sparrow. All right, here we go. Use the music box. Sure. I wish. I wish. I really wish I could just get a recording of this music box right now. <laughs> Gold pieces. Let's just go to bed. Oh, I was so sure this was it. I had this feeling like, like we weren't going to be stuck in Old Town anymore. Why didn't the box take us with it? What are you doing here? I'm sure I didn't wish for you. All right, fine. Welcome to our little paradise. Come on, Sparrow. Go to bed. And much like it says, go to bed. There's nothing more to do today, so... Time to go to sleep. Sleepy, sleepy, sleep. Puppy dog, oh. we got growling. All right, uh, settle down. There's a nice, uh, angry, stray dog. Quiet, boy. What do you want? I work for Lord Lucian, miss. And he would very much like to see you in his castle. I've been sent to collect you. It did work. Our wish came true. Come on, little Sparrow, wake up. It's all right, doggy. We're going to Lord Lucian's castle. I'll come back for you. I promise. Castle? Alrighty then. Let's go to the castle. Castle Fairfax. Evening, Jeeves. Here are the children Lord Lucian asked for. Excellent. Hello, young ladies. Hello, sir. If you'd follow me, please. Oh, we look up at this John castle Beast. every day and Jesus think how Christ, nice it is. Box played and we I both got chills. do. But inside, it's even more beautiful than I imagined. It is quite wonderful, isn't it? Ah, hello, Master Garth. Goodbye, Master Garth. Ha. Huh. A man of few words. Where is the Grand Dining Hall? Oh, in the North Wing. Lord Lucian hasn't been in there since... since the tragic deaths of Lady Fairfax and little Amelia. Oh, I heard. That was so awful. Yes, he uh, misses them terribly. So, where does he eat? Actually, he takes most of his meals in his study. He's in there working all hours doing research. What does he research? Well, history mostly. Much Lord there, Lucian Rose? is quite keen on antiquities of all sorts, but he's chiefly interested in things relating to the old kingdom. There was a trader in Old Town who said his stuff was from the old kingdom. Uh, yes, yes. I believe Lord Lucian heard about that. 
We bought a piece of it, and we made a wish, and now we're here. Well, that's wonderful. Now, when you meet Lord Lucian, you must show respect at all times. Address him as my lord, speak only when spoken to. Yes, sir. And do not mention Lady Fairfax or Amelia. That would be the wise thing, considering they're, you know, dead. Here we are. Lord Lucian, the children are here. Hello. Some study here, dude. Children, it's come to my attention that you have some sort of magic box. May I see it? It vanished, my lord. We were winding it up and we made a wish and then it started to glow and it disappeared. It disappeared. After you used it? Yes, my lord. The man who sold it to us said it was magic. The box is of no interest to me. What's remarkable is that you were able to use it. What was your wish? Oh. <laughs> well, speak up. What did you wish for? Come on, hustler. To live in a castle, like this one. <laughs> Perhaps that could be arranged. I'm working to rebuild... Well, I'm working on something wonderful, for which I need individuals with particular talents. Let us find out if you possess them. Would you kindly stand in the circle, please? Um... I promise it won't hurt you. John Beast, if I remember correctly, your sister is the woman who What's told that? you the box was magic. Nothing to worry about. No, if you remember, Margot was selling it, claiming it was magic. She didn't believe in it, and it was the blind old woman that said, It's a shame that today's children don't believe in Your magic blood. anymore. You are heroes. Heroes? You mean like in the old stories? Ah. What are you? Wait. My lord, what happened? Here. Was... What's that like? Quiet! You're heroes, but you're not any of the three. One of you is the fourth. What's happening? This isn't what I wanted. But nothing must stand in my way. No, wait! Don't! No! I can't allow you to live either. I'm sorry. We all know that that should have been enough to kill anybody. Hero or not. Death is not your destiny today, Little Sparrow. John Beast, yeah, and if I remember correctly, your sister becomes the blind old woman. No, you're thinking of the first Fable game. That old woman is from the first Fable game, and in the first Fable game, Yes, Lucian disappeared from Castle Fairfax that night, certain that those who might stand in his way were dead. But some grief is so great, even death may keep its distance. And so the girl survived. Days later, far from the dark alleys of Bowerstone, life slowly returned to her small, broken body. The girl awoke to a familiar face watching over a strange bed. She reached out for the comfort of the dog's warm fur ready to take her first steps in a new life. Ten winters blanketed Albion. Ten, Ten summers years. filled the air with the sounds of insects and laughter. With time, the girl's pain turned to strength. Her grief became will. A will to change the world and to avenge the death that still haunted her every dream. 
So we are now ten years later. Ah, there you are. And your faithful friend, too. Many years ago, I promised I would help you avenge your sister's death. That day has come. Today, you leave the safety of this camp and seek out Lucian. The journey will not be easy. There's a chest near your caravan. I've left a few things inside that might prove useful. Meet me by the gates when you're ready to leave. So Teresa, this old lady here, Teresa is from the first Fable game, and in that game, she was your character's sister. How long has it been since the events of the first Fable game? <laughs> That's the caveat. I think it's been well over a hundred. Yeah, that's right. A woman is damn near immortal. Because of her magic. It was on a cold and starless night that Perilous fell asleep against an old tree oh, hello, and had the strangest dream. Where's my caravan? Oh, well, follow the glowy trail. I might find my caravan. Goddamn. Is it your birthday? John Beast, yeah, she's as mortal as that damn dog. Ten years, it's already passed, already passed, and that dog hasn't aged a day, but you have. Yeah, you're right. A rusty longsword. So at least I'll give my enemies tetanus. Light splintered crossbow. Slow, clunky. Better than a spitball shooter. A placebo health potion. <laughs> oh my god. It actually makes you feel better. Plus it tastes like sugar. As weak as health potions come. Dog elixir! This pungent potion will cure all your dog's wounds. It will also keep his coat shiny, his nose cool, and his breath smelling like daisies. He gets a better health potion than I do. Okay? Collar of Holding. Effectively bind your dog too. Well, effectively bind your dog too. Well, the collar itself, using ancient magic. It's called a buckle. Use the collar in your inventory to put it on your dog. This also allows you to rename him anytime you want. A spade, which will allow you to dig up things, because yes, the dog will alert you if there's something of interest in the ground to dig up, like treasure. And that's it. So if you go into your inventory where it says quests, maps, there's your quest, birth of a hero, it tells you what you need to do. Let's get out of that. Items. Under miscellaneous, we got the spade, the collar of holding. Uh, we're going to select that. Uh, we'll name the dog later. What should we name the dog? Hey, John Beast. What should we name the dog? What do you think? How I don't are know you, what sexy? To name him wow, yet. nice. Woof, 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 woof. Plus two, attractive. Another one that's says attractive. Now here's another thing. If you do a lot some of evil, clothes? if you, I just want to get away from those people. If you do a lot of good deeds and whatnot, your character will actually get prettier, will stay attractive will start to almost have a glow to them your hair will actually start to turn blonde and your dog will actually start to turn blonde but if you keep doing evil you become very ugly dark your hair starts turning black the dog starts turning black in fact his eyes will also turn red um, from the corruption so right now my character is not too badly looking because I've been doing a lot of good deeds. Woof woof. Really, John? Uh, we're going to go look back into items. Because we weren't done there. Potions. There's my placebo health. Uh, 
Weapons is highlighted. Let's just make sure things are equipped and ready. They should be. Under clothing. Yes, you can run around naked. There you go. But we're not going to do that. I have under here that it's still okay, clothing for some reason ah personality and there is your alignment so you can see how bad with evil and good corrupt or pure and as you can see right now I am simply the opportunist I inhibit a morally gray area doing what I feel like when I feel like it uh, as you get closer to good and pure, your appearance will change, people will react to you differently, and yeah, it's pretty cool like that. You can check and see how renowned you are in certain areas, expressions that you have learned. Um, see here, attractiveness. Again, ugly or attractive. So that's always kind of good to know. And th this is a great way to just keep track of your character, you know? Your stats, groin shots, I love it. How many times you actually shot someone in the groin? <laughs> Decapitations, enemies that have been disarmed. John Beast, if only that carried over into real life. <laughs> I don't know, you'd be pretty evil with it. Money, kills, adventures, games, relationships. People in love with you. How many times you've been married? How many times you've been divorced? How many times you've been widowed? How many children have you had? Most love earned. Most humor earned. Most fear earned. Hey, times had marital sex. Times had extramarital sex. Times that you paid for sex. That's right. You can have sex in this game. <laughs> Just be careful because you can have kids. Yeah. Crime. Other. Food and drink, total alcohol, total potions, time spent drunk, uh, how many times you vomited, how, how many chickens you've kicked, expressions performed, how, f how far have you kicked the chicken, and look at this, STD. Dude, they really brought reality into this game. <laughs> it's great. <laughs> oh, wow. Time played. I have now been playing for 2,061 seconds. And according to my chat box, 63 minutes. There you go. <laughs> the dog. This will let you know how far the dog has progressed. So you know if there's anything you need to do for the dog. Tricks. And you definitely want to learn all the tricks. Because there are demon doors out there. And one of those demon doors requires your character to know a multitude of expressions. But... One of the doors also requires your dog to know a number of tricks. Get them. Uh, combat and treasure hunting. How high of a star rating is the dog at? John Beast. Remember when this game came out? Me, Saber, and Zero were having a contest to see who could get the most STDs. Didn't Zero win that contest? <laughs> These are the expressions. Uh, how many... Quest you've and according to the John Beast, uh, Saber had over a thousand over a hundred and twenty something on STD, so Saber won that bet. Uh, John Beast, I don't know what's going on, but I got to wait screen. Oh, yeah, that's interesting. How did you get a I thought I saw that my thing was paused. Am I back on, John Beast, or are you still on a wait screen? Okay, I'm back on. Is that what the yes was? I'm back on. Okay, okay. 
I'm sorry, I asked two questions at once, and... Yeah. So let's get out of this. Clothing, it's a lie. That exclamation point is a lie. There is nothing new in that category. For some reason, that category stays with that exclamation point mark, so it's a lie. Logbook, we already went through this. Okay, great. Let's, uh, let's save and continue. Let's get this on now. Here we go. Here we go. Now, while you're in the caravan, you can certainly take a moment to... Kick a you trying to give me a heart attack? How do I put my sword away? Oops. Okay, how do I put my sword away? Ah! I can't even remember how to kill a chicken or kick a chicken. All right, so holding the left trigger will highlight a person, and then you can do something either to make her fall in love with you or, or do in this case, I'm gonna dance. Woo! Really quite wonderful. Now, as that thing shrinks, you saw that it went green. Obviously, you want that moving ball to land in the green. That's how you get the most possible. And then, as you can see here, bottom left are the expressions. Great. And obviously, you don't want to do something evil Brilliant. unless you're trying to be evil. What's gift do? Oh, I don't have a gift I can give her. I'm sorry. But if you highlight her... Yes! Yeah! I'm just trying to see just how far I can go with this person. Okay, so they are now attracted to me. You can use flirty, fun, and social expressions to make them like you. Maybe even marry you. Use the directional pad or access the expression wheel RB for more options. Okay. Nicely done. Hold RB. Oh. Are you going to be really so romantic? Fun? I hope so. Not particularly. Not really looking to. Uh... Oh, this is going to be great. Uh, let's do dance. Oh, hey. Now, as you can see on her little bar above her head, uh, there's a ring go. close to the heart. You get that marker all the way over to the ring, that's how you get that's them to marry you. Like to Not too now, bad. what's going on is that other people are watching me behind me. And because they're watching, really they like are also that. targeted, for uh -huh. lack of a better term, and yeah. thus are also got their appreciation of me going Ooh, up. That's not bad at all. Oh, how marvelous. And you I want to start early. Happy. Get people to like now you I'm and happier. love you. It helps with... Okay, her heart is completely red. Which generally Yay! means she's in love. She'll marry me. Sorry, I'm, I'm very picky. Really Really, really love like it. That. Oh, nice. How are you doing? According to John Beast, it will really help when you become a landlord. Exactly. Please, let's see it. Right, I am not looking to do anything with love. Just do this. I just want that guy in love with me, too. Cause you're right, it helps Ooh, when you're in land. It's an unusual fighting style. Excellent. I can't believe how great everything is right now. Oh, that's nice. <laughs> Brilliant there stuff. There we go, he's got a red heart. I'm gonna call him complete.
You know what would be nice? If you spruced yourself up a bit, just a bit. The monks at the Temple of Light try to help people, most of the time. Alright, we're gonna work on this I'm other person. I'm headed to the shops. I'm just not sure which ones. You can buy what you want right here in town. Say something with this person. Good stuff. I guess I yeah, I had to target her. Better and better. Yeah, you know, she has no ring on her icon. What that means is she is not attracted to you in that sense. She will not marry you no matter what you do. Lovely. Thank you. But she can be in love with you as far as a friend goes, and that'll help you as far as your being a landlord, much like John Beast has already commented in the chat box. Yeah. Whoa, no, I don't want to fart. Terrific! Great. Well, let me get back to doing fun things. And I am not farting. If business doesn't pick up soon, I'll be right there. you go. Why does it keep wanting me to fart? I don't want to fart on people. Good God, that's kind of rude. I'm happy. Now I'm happier. Really quite wonderful. I'm working on the gypsy nice camp first it. because, let's face it, they're going to be the first place that I try to buy up as a landlord. Good stuff. Brilliant. Really, really, really love it. Trying to steal my as woman, you can see, I got people Leave coming off. all over the place. I really like that. It's true. <laughs> apparently that guy got pissed because apparently that's his wife. Look at you go. This day oh, just gets better and better. Fighting style. Now look Not at all those hearts bad. popping up. So um, that's how many Amazing. people are apparently being targeted right now. Superb. Simply superb. Oh, that's nice. Hey, sugar. What are you, you know, doing to my husband? I really like that. <laughs> Amazing. Really quite something. Aw, who's a cute little sparrow? All right, so because I'm doing too many flirt things, we're just going to get back Whoa. into no, social. Yay! Look at you go. Yeah. Good. Now I'm happy. Oh. So nice. we're going to keep these all as fun rather than flirty, and that's Come on. because apparently Be funny. we don't want people hating us for like a reason. Oh, great. Marvelous. Oh, yeah, that's not what I'm too bad. About. Oh, that's nice. Love it. Love it. Superb. Simply superb. Oh, I we can't really wait gotta to learn. see what you have in store. We really gotta learn some more expressions, cause this is Yay! not enough. This day just gets better oh, and better. That's an unusual really fighting really style. Well, how about that? Really yes, quite I wonderful. Liked it. Excellent. Yes, go I think on. Whistling is considered flirty. We don't want to do Amazing. that. Apparently, there are some married people in this crowd, and they're gonna start hating me because I'm flirting with their spouse. Oh, so good! Pretty good! Oh, nice! Pretty good. <laughs> Show me. Amazing. That's what I like to see. You're loved by enough people to be Aldian's dumpling. <laughs> so I go to the town crier and I can actually purchase the I was already yes. happy. Now I'm happier. Oh, yes. I love oh, this one. Back to fun. We're just going to do this. Show me more. Right. I like that. 
Great. Oh, how marvelous. I love that. Oh, that's nice. Like it. See, that guy's heart is still only white. Not bad. Got I need potential. That part. Not too bad. Higher. Superb. Wow. Simply superb. I need hey. that heart to be red. Meaning filled. Oh, there we go. That's that's an unusual fighting style. Right. style. Fighting style. I knew Pretty today good. was going to be good. Okay, again, her heart is all the way up, but she won't fall in love with me. Neither will she. Right to see Neither ya. will she. I've got you. But he will, Run. so here we go. Oh, let's do some dancing. What I'm talking about. Can't catch me. Can't Whoa. really. Oh, that was but you good. Can't catch me. Amazing. Amazing. Well, well, how about that? Let's run. Just showed my dog some love. Because yes, how you treat your dog will also make a difference in how people treat you. They see you. They see you abusing your dog. They start right. hating you. I mean, oh, good. Maybe even great. Marvelous. Kill the dog. No, are not killing the dog. This will be great. Oh, oh, wow. Wow. Great. Got a good crowd of people over here. That's another thing. If you can get a crowd of people, like not. that really Love helps. Because then you're getting that many people at once. Mm, good. Ah, now I approve of that. I can say I like that a lot. Oh, good stuff. That was yes, brilliant. Yes, good. Pretty fine. Ha <laughs> ha, brilliant. There we go. Yippee! I'm gonna try and get it as Lovely. far up as I can. Great. There we go. Yeah. Great. Oh yeah. Good. Yay! I can't help liking that. Wonderful. I see it. I like it. Oh yes. Wonderful. Great. Just great. I mean oh, that. Wow. Great. Oh. That was good. Oh, good. Stuff. I think a little bit here though. I am gonna kill the stream, everybody. Nice. Stuff. Oh, how marvelous. Oh, yeah. Good. yeah, good. That's good. Alright, I think I'm gonna call it quits for right ha. there, just for now. Let me go ahead and save my progress. Ah, brilliant. And I think also I'm gonna go ahead and kill this stream. Um I know this was kind of an off one the memory card but the game is old enough to be on the memory card <laughs> now that John B's confirmed that this game's 11 years old so it's not as old as Oblivion but it meets the criteria for the memory card so that being said thank you for joining me don't forget to check out my YouTube's video um, I'm also on YouTube under Darth Beauty uh, check out my husband John Beast 317 he is on Mixer as well as YouTube and of course check out our co-stream Beauty and the Beast until next time, everybody, have a good night, stay safe, and as always, game on!